Hello and welcome to Silent Creativa. To get a small break from all the door repaints and just because I have it and think it's cute, I decided to make one of these miniature things again. After I made the dollhouse repaint, um, I bought a bunch of these and thought I would like to change them in a similar style, but with this one I wasn't quite sure what to do. I thought about yeah, making it into a Harry Potter theme or a lot of different things came to my mind, but nothing was really convincing me to do it. And so I thought I'd just do it like it is, because um, I think it's damn cute. And the second part is to restyle the box from the outside would be a little bit difficult, because I don't have the right colors and tools for it. So this will be more of a review than a DIY or something like that. After I checked the things that should be inside, I yeah started with the uh, all the little details, and I have to say this is quite a lot of details. I think I used three different kind of glues because normally this would come with glue, but it looks like they are not allowed to import glue into the EU, and so, yeah, you have to use your own one. I ordered this one from Wish, I think, um, but you are able to get them nearly everywhere on the internet. Um, I found them on eBay, on Amazon on yeah a ton of different platforms and yeah you can get them for quite low prices and what I really like about these sets is they come with everything you need yeah the only one no only thing you have to add to it is glue and a simple crafting glue and some super glue would be enough for it, yeah. And you really have to work with tweezers because there are so many little details. It's uh, freaking strange to get all this together. Um, I have to do some things again and again because First I build something and then I'm a bit clumsy and destroy it again and yeah, and it's kind of tricky, but I think in the end it's quite fun and you have a really nice piece in the end and yeah. When I did the witch kitchen, I made everything in the order I thought it would be okay and for this one I decided to go step by step and follow the instructions which was quite helpful and quite good. Some things are a little bit difficult to understand but you can work with it and yeah if you want to build something like this the same way it is shown the instructions are really clear and oh quite clear, sometimes not, um, but it's fairly easy. Just when you want to change a lot of things, you really have to think it through and that is something that I'm quite bad at.
though the different shops were the main part, making all the little details and furnitures was a little bit more stressful because nothing wanted to stay and be built in the way it should be because my fingers are a little bit too thick for something like this and yeah if you have some small fingers this would be great but for someone with sausage fingers it was a little bit uh, tricky to do so there were some little things that I switched or changed or left out, like the flower pots and yeah, in the original photo one of these pots should be hanging from the ceiling and, and no. Just no. But I think though this is a quite small change, it is okay. I really had a lot of struggles to glue the clock and one of the signs down to the 
metal and yeah because nothing was working I finally took out some tape taped them down and hide the floors with some flowers that are in the package and yeah that was quite okay I had the same problem with the uh, strip of lights I really had to glue them down lamp by lamp by lamp by lamp because gluing everything in place in one row wasn't quite easy maybe I, w I was just not patient enough but yeah at least it, everything is where it should be and I'm quite happy with the end result oh yeah and I have to say no I'm not sponsored or anything in this direction I just really like this kind of stuff and yeah I really like that you have that much detail and um yeah so I hope you liked watching me do this and um, maybe you would like to do one uh, of this for your own uh, what I think it's is quite cute you have a stand with this which is in bunny form and yeah I'm I totally adore these <laughs> little things and I really would like to do some more of this <laughs> So, thank you for watching, have a nice week, and until next time, bye.